We have enough arrows now. We must deliver them to Sun Quan's forces. <laughs> Looks like I'm on a roll. Very. Are we ready for the upcoming showdown? I must check and make sure. I'm surprised. We actually managed to gather so many arrows so quickly. This will give us plenty of archers to strike the enemy. Our plot was a success. It looks like the enemy has bought Wang Gai's defection. Okay, this is the time to rest and ready our mind and spirit for what lies ahead. We must be prepared for the coming battle. It seems that Cao Cao's fleet has begun making its way south. So they've made their move. When will we launch the fire attack? Setting the fire trap now would be ineffective. I require a little more time. If we succumb to the enemy attack now, all of our preparations will have been for naught. We must hold off their attack until we are ready to launch the fire attack. I understand. Tell our men that we must endure the coming enemy assault. The final showdown has arrived. We shall use our fire attack to burn down Zhao Zhao's ships. As soon as we've drawn them in. Wait for the proper moment. And then launch our boat. Everybody, we just need to hold out until then! We've placed archers all along the river. The enemy won't cross easily like this. This is also thanks to those 10,000 arrows. Men, let's do our best too! The time has come!
we start the plan to taunt South South's forces, we're ready to launch! Understood. We'll get a rise out of them. Don't worry. Hey! South South! You want a piece of us? Come get it! Their attempt to taunt us is pathetic. They must realize they need a desperate plan if they hope to win this battle. It is time for us to crush our weakened opponent and claim our victory. All units, advance on the enemy main camp! Our target has been determined. Capturing that area will deflate their morale. Capturing the enemy's bases is the key to defeating them. be defeated, no matter what you are scheming. Now, bow down before my ambition. We will fight to the last man if we have to! Yeah! Yeah! 
you continue this desperate struggle, it will do you no good in the end. I must pull back here, but my ambition is not yet extinguished. Wow, somebody even lazier than I am. Magnificent job. I'm glad you're on our side. Why haven't the southeastern winds started blowing yet? Joe Yu, we cannot wait much longer. If the winds don't pick up soon... Wait. Did the direction of the wind just change? Master Zhou Yu, the wind! The winds are blowing, just as we anticipated! My lord, give the order to march! Okay, order the forces of U to crash down on Cao Cao like a hurricane! Yes, my lord! All units, prepare the fire attack! We shall sink Cao Cao's navy to the bottom of the Shangjiang! Master Huang Gai, get ready to launch the fire ship! Understood! This is gonna be the greatest battle any of us have ever seen! Just wait, Cao Cao! The flames of Wu shall engulf your ambition whole! Let's go! This battle's ours for the taking! Master Huang Gai has shown us the way. Listen, men of Sun Wu, have courage! It's time for us to defeat Cao Cao! <laughs> Now, we have been running, but not anymore. Just wait, Cao Cao. I will have your head on a spike! This is our chance to claim Cao Cao's head. We must catch him before he can flee to Cao Ren's side. We must defeat Cao Cao before he can meet up with his allies. All units, begin the pursuit immediately! That camp is on fire! It worked! But, shouldn't the fire be larger than that? Maybe because preparations for the fire attack were blocked by the enemy. Whew. We made it away from the fire. Oh. We're just lucky it didn't reach our ship. You're right. If the ships had been linked, they would have all been lost. We cannot afford to lose this position! I shall personally see to its defense! Hup. Hup. 
It's Liu Bei. Maybe something good will come out of this yet. I'll go and put an end to him myself. The enemy's momentum is too great, but I must not be defeated here. I found Liu Bei, but failed to do anything about it. I hate how powerless I am. Zhao Shu has been driven off. This should allow us to meet up with our allies. Wow, somebody even lazier than I am. That went well. Now, let's head on home. You're doing an excellent job. We shall defend this position. Do not allow a single enemy through. All right. I need everyone to defend this area. We cannot allow Master Cao Cao to fall in battle here. Uh, quickly, begin our glorious advance to meet up with the main unit. This is as far as you go. There's gonna be nothing left for you but ashes when I'm done. Now is the time for us to launch our attack. It shall change the course of this battle. No choice but to retreat in a graceful manner. Master Cao Cao, please be careful out there. All right, that's the spirit. We can use this momentum to chase down Cao Cao and secure victory. Wow, somebody even lazier than I am. That went well. Now, let's head on home. Words simply can't express how amazing you are.
Report! Lord Salren awaits you! This battle will be won if we can meet up with Salren. If we can't, then we are as good as dead. He's marching on Cao Cao! Thank goodness! Thank goodness! We've still got some fight left in us. Sun Jian, so this is what your children have become. Impressive. Cao Cao managed to elude our pursuit somehow. However, It'll be some time before he can recover from this defeat. We have an excellent opportunity to build up our forces while the enemy's unable to move. This is our chance to make a play for the land. Cao Cao's army has pulled back. It seems we have won this battle. You fought magnificently, Master Sun Chuen. The courage displayed by the men of Wu was most impressive. <laughs> you weren't too bad yourself, Lord Liu Bei. Isn't that right, brother? Please desist, Lady Shang Shang. You must not praise me when I do not deserve it. It embarrasses me. Unfortunately, we let Cao Cao get away. Yes, but that was to be expected. All we needed to do in this battle was claim victory over Cao Cao's forces, and we have done that. Yes, I could not agree with you more. You are right. We should savor this accomplishment. I am relieved that we successfully defended Wu's territory. That was most impressive, my lord. I only wish Master Sun Jian and Master Sun Se could have seen you in action. Everyone! There will be a grand banquet to celebrate our victory. Tonight, we shall eat, drink, and be merry until the sun rises! Oh, that's what I like to hear! I'll invite my friends and really make this a party to remember. Master Sun Chuen, please try not to let yourself get carried away this evening. Master Zhuge Liang, I must thank you again for your cooperation. Because of you, we were able to protect Wu from Cao Cao. Not at all. I simply provided what support I could for Master Zhou Yu's plan. We owe this victory to the courage and intellect of the men of Wu. My only regret is that we were unable to slay Cao Cao. It does not seem to bother you, though. You said previously that it was to be expected. It's almost as if you knew that Cao Cao would survive the battle. Yes. I anticipated that Cao Cao would survive. Besides which, it would be troubling for us were Cao Cao to be killed just yet. Now, if you will excuse me, I must take my leave. It would be troubling if Cao Cao were to be killed. Just what are you planning, Zhuge Liang? Master Zhuge Liang, I appreciate the help you've given us. No, honestly, our victory was entirely thanks to your brilliance. You flatter me, Master Zhou Yu. Our victory at Qi Bi has given us an excellent opportunity to attack Jing Province. Cao Cao's army is exhausted after such a long march. 
It will not be ready to fight any time soon after its retreat, leaving Jing ripe for the taking. So, what is your next move, Master Zhuge Liang? Master Zhou Yu, you are fighting to realize a land ruled by Wu, a land ruled by Master Sun Chun. I am doing the same for my people. I am doing all I can to help Master Liu Bei rule this land one day. That is all. What are you planning? I am afraid I'm not at liberty to divulge any details at this time. I can say only that I wish to divide the land in three. I am working toward that goal. I look forward to seeing you again soon, Master Zhou Yu. Divide the land in three? It seems Zhuge Liang has yet another grand scheme up his sleeve. We have crushed Cao Cao at Chibi. This is the dawn of a new age for the forces of Wu. Mm, it is important that we do not get ahead of ourselves. Yes, you're right. We may have beaten him this time, but Cao Cao's army is still quite powerful. It will take time before we can completely overcome him. The wars that plague this land are far from over. The chaos continues. Don't look so glum, Xu Shang. If the chaos continues, then it's up to us to bring an end to it. You're absolutely right, Zhu Rang. Master Zhou Yu. Our victory at Chi Bi is merely the start of our offensive. In other words, the battle is just beginning. We will require the assistance of your generation. You must continue to grow and improve for the battles to come. The battles to come? It sounds as if our path has already been decided. In a sense, it has. We are planning to seize Nanjun in Jing province. I would like for all of you to join me for this invasion. Nanjun is guarded by the defensive stalwart Cao Ren. It will not be an easy battle. Leave it to me then. I have yet to meet a man who can withstand the heat of my fire attacks. Master Zhou Yu, I don't suppose our next battle will be another joint effort with Liu Bei then? That is correct. This battle is entirely up to us. We only teamed up with them to repel Cao Cao's attack. Our alliance is a mere formality now that it is over. Actually, Zhuge Liang has already begun making his move in Jing province. I believe he is planning to capture it before we can. To steal it out from under us. Given our performance at Chibi, Jin province should belong to Wu. We can't let Liu Bei take it away. I see. Cao Cao is not our only enemy. Liu Bei? No. Zhuge Liang is someone we must be wary of as well. Yes, indeed. However, our current focus must be on taking Nanjun. Cao Cao's army may be weakened, but it is still formidable due to its sheer size. We shall have our scouts keep an eye on Zhuge Liang's movements. We must capture Jing province before he does. Once Nanjun is ours, the land will be divided in two. Everybody, I am counting on you to lead U to victory once more! Lord Sun Chuen, we're making the preparations for our impending departure. That's good to hear. Thank you for all your hard work, Lian Xu. Hey! Those seem to be getting along rather well lately, don't you think? Yes. They appear to have the ideal ruler and vassal relationship. 
I agree. Lady Leon Shi is quite the skilled warrior. Our lord could not ask for a more capable attendant. That's not what I meant. <laughs> oh well, you men just don't get it. Seeing them like that makes me a bit jealous. I only wonder if there's anybody out there for me. What? That's what you were talking about? Just thinking of you leaving us to marry some man is enough to make me cry! It appears our lord has finished making his preparations. Is everybody ready to join the attack on Nanjun? Master Cheng Pu? What's the matter? You're unusually quiet today. Something's been bothering me lately. Zhou Yu seems almost too eager to leap into action. I'm worried that he's playing right into the enemy's hands. Ha! I never expected you to be one to worry about Zhou Yu, Master Cheng Pu. You're getting soft at your old age. He is an important leader of Wu. We cannot afford to lose him at this critical juncture in our history. I'm not sure what to think. But if Master Cheng Pu is worried about him, then I suppose we should be too. This is the moment of truth for Wu. We cannot allow any harm to come to Master Zhao Yu. I agree. I only hope Cheng Pu's fears turn out to be unfounded. Hey, cheer up everybody. It's good to have a healthy dose of concern, but it's equally important to keep your spirits up. Now, let's make our way to Nanjun. Our strategy is just like we discussed. We will join Master Zhou Yu in his attack on Nanjun. That I understand. What I want to know is, why have you stuck me with this creep, Master Lu Meng? Why don't you just shut your mouth already and get out there and fight? What? <laughs> Surely you're joking. You don't really expect me to get out there and fight alongside the man that killed my father. Are you still hung up on that? Get over it already. Silence, both of you. Have you forgotten your promise to our lord that you'd work together? Hmm. <laughs> ha! This situation is less than ideal. Although, it is my job to control these two. We have received word that Liu Bei's army is in Jing province. If so, it means Zhuge Liang is looking to use us to take it back. Even after our help at Chibi. We cannot let them have their way. Nanjun and Jing province belong in the hands of Wu. We must slay Xiao Ren and Yang Ling in order to obtain Jing province. It is imperative that we... Hmm, what is that? Huh? Why are we running like that? What's wrong? Did something bad happen? R reporting Lord Zhou Yu has been <laughs> shot by an arrow. He needs aid at once. Huh? Lord Zhou Yu's hurt? We've got to go help him! We made it in time. Now we must quickly reform our ranks and go to the aid of our allies.